Oh, I have changed my hats. There we go. That's better. RMD Promotions out of Meet America. You. soft and there's feed left in the bunk so this is not going to be fun well that was fun uh but not really about got stuck going in there about got stuck coming out um, for the most part out i'm just gonna walk back up to the water tanks yeah that's uh those are ruts on a good note <clears throat> the video I just put up I showed you guys all that water that was standing here Look at that It's actually soaking up The wind is blowing That's always a real good <clears throat> Real good sign when the wind's blowing Help dry some stuff out Here's a better look at what these bowls look like that we use <clears throat> They're Wagyu bowls they got to be able to be traced back to the first two uh, the first two original Wagyu's in Japan and uh, whoo god dang I'm out of breath walk all that way girls you get out of breath that easy god dang but there they are they're supposed to be reasonably docile uh, they won't let you come up and pet them though oh, alright got me a pair of sunglasses not a new pair in my pickup 3M safety glasses. Pick them up at the local bongars. Woo! Yeah, now we're in action. Um, it's moist. Look, look how moist it is out there. Hey, girls, girls, be careful out there. It's pretty moist. So Friday. The guy sent me a picture of that pair I have up here. The nursing on their own, kind of. Um, they said they had to walk the calf up to it, and my mom stood there and let him nurse. He said the same thing for yesterday. All they did was fill a tub up with some feed here, and uh, she ate, calf nursed. I tried that again. She will not allow it. Maybe it's me. Maybe I'm the culprit. Oh, man. Ugh. Guys, it's really moist. Oh, man. It is definitely a Sunday. One, it's really moist. Two, things keep breaking. Ooh, old cowboy Tanner got one. I'm going to say that's an AIP. He don't look too promising at all. I'm gonna say you're an AIP. Dang it. Would have gotten rid of a lot of moisture on there. And uh, yeah, I bet that rye would just <laughs> ignite. Man, if we get some sun days, some sunny days, uh, that rye is gonna be five foot tall in no time. Oh man, there's gonna be so much rye. So much rye. There's supposed to be a bolt right there. Sunday fun day is pretty much over. 
I'm gonna feed a couple of loads with Charlotte here to help the feedlot guys out. And uh, that way we can all get out of here at a decent time. I don't got much battery left, but you guys ever seen the back end of a feed wagon? There you go. That is not supposed to be like that. Remember what I said, it was gonna be a, bo a moist manic Monday? It is. Chain's all right here. I just gotta figure out the pattern to get it back and connected and I'm hoping I got a connecting link somewhere. I don't know for sure. I had to call in the big guns, folks. I can't remember. I had to call in the big guns. We got mechanic! After further investigation from Go Go Gadget Nick, I think we got the chain put back in. Now we need a link, but after looking at chains, we may have to replace some. Okay, we're finally getting somewhere. Cows are fed, it's a load of silage, fix the Oswald. Uh, we're not so moist today either. And that's my lunch today. That's my lunch today. Happy Tuesday, everybody. Whole bunch of super punchers out there gonna out super punch a super puncher. Last time they didn't, uh, they didn't, they couldn't figure it out, but it was our first time. I gotta go up through the trees there. In a hole, in a hole, like you, you're not gonna be a good heifer. That's awesome. No, it was my fault, I did it. But, I was stupid, got in a hurry, turned too sharp, caught it with a tire, broke it off. Mechanic saved my ass again. Pretty soon this is gonna be the Nick work time channel. Yeah, pretty much, just as well. <laughs> Metric wrench. Metric wrench. <laughs> that guy's a swell guy. If it wasn't for him, I'd be really screwed. All right. Lots of projects today. New axle on the trailer with new brakes. Grease job on this thing. Oh look, got a load cell that's screwed up. That makes sense. back in off the hill there and we're gonna work everybody <clears throat> cams will get vaccinated cows will get a shot I believe well that went really easy so what they're doing is they're trying to sort cows with ca or sort the calves off the cows we gotta get all the calves vaccinated before we send them up to meat. We're slowly making progress on this. Quick shot, pour everybody and kick them out.
Uh, we're gonna get cows in, get them worked, and uh, yeah, and then we head, and then uh, and then everybody goes to mead. All right, boss man showed up, so I'm gonna take off and head up there to mead and try and get some of this stuff fed, then turn around and come back, get another load of feed, and head back up there to get these girls fed. So here we go. You guys remember a couple weeks ago when I was up here and there was all this snow and ice from the water tanks. Now it's just super moist. Oh look, there's a bull. While the cows is fed water, the, the new additional fall calvers are working their way up here. They got the rawhide set up way back over yonder there. And uh, they're bringing up the uh, fall calvers and calves. Uh, first load is on its way up here right now. I get this fed off. I gotta head back. Uh, we're gonna gather up some pipe to get, uh, where is our water tanks? Our water tanks are right there at the center point. Get some pipe loaded up so we can get water out here. And I'm gonna saddle a pony. We're gonna let uh, we're gonna let all those girls sit for a couple hours and let them get paired back up, so that we don't got cows going one way and calves going another way, and then just a, a royal wreck of things would happen. Saddled, ready to rock and roll, ain't you, dude? Be about an hour, be about an hour, maybe two, maybe an hour and a half. Let's go do some cowboy shit. Ready to do some cowboy shit, dude? Oh, goodness. Oh, goodness. Stop being fat. Turn them out there, I'm assuming. We're going to cowboy the shit out. Well, that wasn't very much fun. Can we chase, can we? I was gonna say, can we chase one? You winded already? Cow fight. Girls, go get some food. Dad. You're way out of shape, dude. You shouldn't have ran. The boys behave now, okay? You worked up pretty good sweat there, doggers. Come on, Rhonda, load up. All right, bud. You know what to do. Thanks for being awesome. Well, folks, that's a Wednesday. Good morning, YouTubers! We got all the cows off the petri dish up there. Thank God. Thank God. They're all up in Mead, and that's where I'm headed. Mead, America. Feed fall calvers and Wyoming cows. Y'all! It starts getting this warm for this, this early that, that usually we don't get no rain in the summer. So close to 30. So close. If you want food, you gotta move, fatty. Come on, fatty. Get out of the way. Where's 924? Man, we gotta do some dehorning. I've seen at least five of them that got horns. That's the downfall of these Wagyu bulls. You can't get them. Oh yeah, there's a good-sized one, one right there. Uh, 
<clears throat> these wagyu bulls though they they got horns they got horns i don't like horns but they got horns look at that guy look at the horns on that guy let's lay out another line so they can do a bump i still think we're another week out before we get our next calf the closest one is just really starting to put on a bag here this week, so I still think we're about another week out. I could be wrong. I usually am. That one I took out. That one I know is missing, but all these other ones are loose. That could have been a real bad deal. Well... Finding more broken parts. I think this one must have just happened. Normally we break this top bolt. Broke the bottom one this time. Hopefully I got something here. And we got Butler Ag coming out doing some updates on our uh, on our big organic tractor here. So it's uh, it's getting to be farming season. Blah. are playing look at that they are feeling good hi kiddos that is an excellent sign i love that these wyoming cows are impressive they didn't even care that i had feed in there until they started pulling out of here i think they more walk out well, no nope, there's nobody up around the water tank either but there's a whole bunch of green starting to show up and they care more about that green than they do the feed and the bumps. They know how to fend for themselves. Dang, Wyoming cows is good cows. Woo, C and L. All right, boys. These guys are great agricultural fix-it guys. We've had that hole there for quite a while. They're finally coming to get her fixed up. That's a good feeling. I gotta go sit in a skid steer and I have a heck of a time putting a mount or anything like that in there right now so I'll see you guys on Saturday because Saturday sounds like we're going horseback